Hey guys, what's up? It's Minitelf, and today I'm going to show you how to update your Craft Bucket server. In the last video, I showed you how to update your regular Minecraft server, and now Craft Bucket servers need to be updated a lot more if you want to stay on top. I would say maybe like every three hours or less, there's a new Craft Bucket out, and I don't think you need to update that often, but in case you are still on the old one from my old pre made folder, you want to update to the new one. So, this video is going to show you how it's a little bit more complicated than updating a Minecraft server, but it's not hard. So, first thing you want to do is check out the link in the description, and it will take you to this page. So, as you can see, since I put out my um, Minecraft server video, I was right here. This is I updated my pre-made folder, and all the releases that came out. So, new releases are released all the time. So, the first thing you want to do is, before you click on anything like me, find the latest build and if there is a recommended build I would click that one but notice how right here there is a red dot do not get the ones with the red dots that means they are a failed test and they will not work properly so you want to get the top one that if there's no recommended build if there's a recommended build then I would get that one so just go ahead and click to download it takes a little longer than a minecraft server and we're going to close this Give it a second. There we go. Close this and put this on your desktop. If you don't have your actual downloads thing down here, you can find it in your finder and then your name and then downloads. So put it on your desktop. So to you're going to need to rename this to craftbucket.jar. So to rename it, you click on it press enter that's the only way I use and delete everything up to the T of craft bucket and there you go craft bucket dot jar and we'll go into our server and we're gonna delete the old craft bucket dot jar and put in the new one and I'm gonna clean it up just to make it look good and I like to have mine highlighted in gray so these are all the important things you need to make note of in the server so now we are going to start up the server Here we go, and it seems to be working, version 1.1, and it's generating a new world, yada yada yada, just to let you know, it worked. So, I'm going to wait for this to generate, it doesn't really matter. So, that's how you update your craft bucket server. If you want to know how to update a Minecraft server, it will be a link in the description also. So, thanks for watching this video, and we'll see you guys later. Peace. So, on screen we have two videos. On the left, this will show you how to update your Minecraft server. So in case you have a normal Minecraft server, not a craft bucket server, this is the video you want to watch to update it. And on the right, this will show you how to actually make a craft bucket server in case you didn't even know how. So these are very great tutorials if you were just starting out on learning what to do with Minecraft servers. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.